right. Well, um, our chicken is done. So that's always a good thing. So, let's go ahead and do something that I have been meaning to do for, uh, quite some time, honestly. And that is we have all this, uh, this enchanting power, uh, just going to waste, uh, honestly. So we need to make an enchanting table really quick. Um, I have paper now. Need some leather. Make a book. Oh, the trouble, the trouble, the trouble, right? Okay, well, our book, I, I honestly have made a crafting table, or not a crafting table, an enchanting table, like once, I think. Um, I just gotta remember how to make this now. Crap. Okay, maybe... Is it two diamonds on the side, maybe? And maybe all obsidian? There we go, okay. Man, I was... yeah. <laughs> it's been a long time since I've seen that. So, uh, I, I feel... I feel totally accomplished right now. That's, that's no joke, no joke. I really... There, there's a certain sense of pride, uh, when you can build an enchanting table. My god. Alright, well, let's go ahead and do our, our worst. Um, oh crap, I, um, why did I do that? Okay, my bad. I wanted a higher, uh, enchantment on that. But, like a noob, I swear. Alright, that's better. Too bad that's iron. Piece of crap. Okay. Should we make up a new diamond pickaxe? Maybe. Do we have any more diamonds? Yes, we do! Yes, we do! The real question is, though, do we have any wood? Um... Schnikes. Okay. I have steak. <laughs> I have steak, so that can substitute as wood, right? Uh, just run around with, like, a... a uh, cow bone as like our handle. That would be pretty cool actually, but uh, no, no, unfortunately that's not the case. Uh, I forgot about that frog skin. We had a book in here all along, dang it. Why did I forget about such things? Okay, well, let's go ahead and Toss some coal in the old furnace just to get out of my inventory. And, uh, yeah. <laughs> a raptor is full, in case you didn't know. <laughs> my god. It's, it's like, um, you know, I, I just don't pay attention when that comes up. I'm just like, eat Tyrone! Eat! <laughs> and he just refuses it. So, uh, that, that kind of blows. <laughs> but, you know, I mean, seriously, it, it's an all-you-can-eat buffet. And, uh, Tyrone, he, he just gets so full so easily. But, uh, I guess he is a little baby. So, you know, what are you gonna do? But, we need wood. So we're getting some more wood. Um, I'll probably go ahead and take this whole tree down, honestly. Because, I'll be honest, um, I'm never really big, uh, a big fan of low-lining trees that uh, just kind of obstruct my view, you know, especially near my home. Like, if there's a little baby tree uh, just growing in the sand, especially, I'll, I'll knock that sucker out and uh, and say, what were you thinking, tree? You know, growing, growing in the sand. What's your problem? Uh, <laughs> and, and the tree is just going to look at me like, why? I, I just give oxygen to you. And I'll say, no, tree. No, you... You, 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 you need to be destroyed. <laughs> Alright. Um, yeah, so. Eco-activist unite, right? Jeez. Oh, Tyrone, Tyrone, Tyrone. What mischief awaits you today? Um, uh, I had to eat before I got to the hatchery. Because after all, after all, uh, if Tyrone sees me eating, um... That might cause a problem. Uh, you never know. 
you never know. You don't want to have your dinosaur uh, watching you ingest something that uh, that you feed it on a regular basis, and then think, you know, oh, that's that's supposed to be my stuff. Uh, where are you, Tyrone? Oh, oh, I think yeah, there you are. Looks like he's caught in a loop. What the heck, Tyrone? Y your world is bigger than four blocks. Come on, man, move around. Ah, <sighs> is he getting hung up on like that grass or something? Maybe. Let's. I don't want to hit Tyrone. Yeah, get out of here, Tyrone. Maybe we can clear away this grass. Um. I'm just scared to death. Like, my luck, right? My luck. Um. If I start clearing away grass, this, this will end badly. Um. I don't know why I'm not picking up that chicken. I watched, I walked past it like five times, and it's just laying there. Maybe it's like stale. Maybe it has like some kind of uh, uh, meat disease or something. Like obviously not mad cow, but what kind of meat disease uh, would there be, really? Um, I don't know. I don't know. I don't know why I keep trying to feed my raptor either. <laughs> like I just said something about how full it was, and. Uh, and what do I do? I feed him once and then I feed him like four more times. Just stupidity at his finest, you know? My god. Well, I think I left something back at the treehouse. Um, I can never keep my thoughts together. If I could, it would save a lot of time in this series. Because, <laughs> I mean, let's be honest. I wouldn't be running all the way back to, uh, to the treehouse for a freaking book. Uh, that I locked over here, but uh, we gotta get we gotta get the Dinopedia, I believe it's like Wikipedia, uh, but for dinos. So I think is it in here? No, no, just a worthless chain chest plate. Who wants a chain chest plate? You know, nobody. It's worthless. I would rather run around nude. And wear like an ugly chain chest plate. I mean, seriously, wouldn't, wouldn't a chain chest plate just like make you colder? Like, there's no advantage to it, none whatsoever. I I would I would die of embarrassment before I would wear a chain chest plate. That's just me. But there it is, Dinopedia, Dinopedia, and frozen meat. I forgot all about this frozen meat. Uh, thanks to somebody in the comments who said something uh, a few episodes back that you can get uh, DNA from frozen meat. Totally forgot about that. Totally forgot. And, and first try! How cool is that? The very first try. How many fossils did we go through to get our first fossil, uh, you know, dino DNA? And now, you know, Frosty Period Park, uh, it's it's all that much closer to, <laughs> to, to happening. Uh, that is awesome. That is awesome. So, we'll just uh, keep our saber tooth DNA uh, safe and sound at the treehouse. I don't want to carry that around after all, you know. You never know what, uh, what thievery awaits you uh, in the, the tropics after all. So, let's go ahead and head on back. And we're going to use this book, right? Uh, we're going to use this book to find out... How far along our dino is? Little, little, little Tyrone. Um, I believe it's been three days since we put him down. So he should be, he should be turned into adult, I would imagine, relatively soon. Um, if we can click on him. I think you left click on him. Left, left, where? God damn it, Tyrone. Come on. Zero days? What? I. How? Tyrone. I don't know! <laughs> that was his answer. Um. Alright, seriously, I'm, I'm, I'm flabbergasted. Uh. I mean, you guys saw, right? Like, days did pass. I'm not going crazy here. Uh, me and Tyrone had a whole uh, communique going on here. 
and now it's like he just came out of the shell. What is the deal? Um, crap. I, 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 ju I just, I, I don't know. I don't know. Um, we'll, we'll give him some steak. Maybe, maybe that'll help somehow. Um, I don't know why it would, of course. And somehow it did. Maybe... I don't know. Maybe, like, every day you have to get them to 100% uh, health or something. Or 100% full. And then maybe maybe he turns into an adult after that. Well, that is just weak, Tyrone. You let me throw away all kinds of steak. Right? And you didn't even tell me that I needed the freaking Dinopedia to, to make you older. What a jerk. What an unbelievable jerk. I mean, honestly. Like, first rule, right? First rule in coming back from the dead is you tell people exactly what you need to grow up. And and Tyrone failed to uh to do that. That son of a gun, you know? Oh well. What are you gonna do? So it's almost dark once again. God, it's such a long walk back from that that freaking hatchery. You know? I mean, I'm really putting the miles on my old my old square boots. Um Maybe 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 there's like some kind of facilities uh that I can use closer by or I can create my own or something, I don't know. But let's go ahead and make up some sticks like we were talking about earlier to oh uh, I was gonna make a diamond pickaxe but yeah I probably should probably should let's just do it there we go new diamond pickaxe lovely we'll enchant it and there we go eight beautiful what do I got on that? Unbreaking. Okay. So that'll do. That'll do for a while. Let's go ahead and dump off this uh this saber cat DNA into the extractor or cultivator, rather. Cultivator? Yeah, that's a cultivator, I think. Um funny how the saber tooth embryo looks a lot like the Velociraptor embryo, isn't it? I mean, it's a little shocking, to be honest, because they look nothing alike, and they're not even the same species, or, you know, same, uh, same subspecies, rather, but they look alike, so, whatever, um, don't know, don't know what that's about, but enchant my boots, I wish that I could enchant more, but for now, I'll run around with purple stockings, and, uh, enjoy it. You know, <laughs> why not, right? Why not? Nobody else is on this island uh, except for the professor, of course, and uh, and and the guy at Frosty Period Park. But that's not really on the island, so we will uh, just kind of chill and relax and wait for our saber tooth to get done. Um, I I'm I'm kind of wondering how this is going to turn out. Just a little bit, because like obviously saber tooth tigers would not come from uh you know I keep saying saber tooth tigers I should be saying smilodons but I'm not so I apologize in advance if I keep saying saber tooth tigers but uh it's what I grew up with you know so um right. So anyway, I, I, I just kind of am wondering, like, how... Like, obviously he's not going to hatch from an egg, you know? So how is he going to come into this world? I mean, that, that, that this, this is seriously something that is very, very disconcerting to me. Because, um, like, if we, were in, if we were in Glacier Park, right? Like, Glacier Park... Uh, he would, he would be in an incubation chamber. So what 
what exactly is he going to use to come out of? You know, he needs warmth. He needs, like, a physical body to to be grown in. Um, he's not using mine. He's not <laughs> using mine. That would be very disconcerting. Um, I... Can I eat a cookie? I'm really hungry. Uh, no. No, I'm not hungry. But I am hungry. <laughs> oh, well. Cookie goes back. But yeah, um, maybe... Maybe we have to, like, use use a pig. Or, or a cow or something. I wonder if a sheep would work. Maybe? Probably not. Huh. Well, how's our smile down looking? Still not done. God. You were just taking forever, aren't you? Come on. Like, the Velociraptor didn't take this long. I know that for a fact. Like, the Velociraptor, he was, like, little Tyrone, he was a champ when he came out of that that cultivator. He went in, and he was done in, like, maybe two minutes. And the saber tooth tiger is just, like, pissing away time left and right. I, I, I just don't get it. I really don't. But, nevertheless, uh, we just have to chill and wait for him to get done. Come on, you little pixelated booger. Finish! Finish! <laughs> Come on! Ah. It, it looks like it's done, doesn't it? Maybe this is a sign that it's gonna break. We'll just stay back here and wait for a minute, and uh, if it disappears, we'll be good. But otherwise, I don't want to, like, you know, be shorthanded against a, a vertically challenged creeper. That would be bad. All right. He's all done. Whoa. Whoa, 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 whoa. Okay, so we need a womb to, uh, to, <laughs> I can't believe I'm saying that. We need a womb to create a saber tooth, uh, or a Smilodon, rather. Jeez. All right, well, saber cat, Smilodon, saber tooth. I mean, honestly, there's like three different names for one thing that we're using. Ridiculous. Well, let's go back. We'll check in on Tyrone. Maybe he's a day older, a day wiser. Um, maybe he can uh, shed some light on where we're going with him next. Because I don't want to start like the Sabretooth uh, program. Uh, obviously, we're going to have to catch an animal to uh, to even do that. Because I don't want to, I don't want to just put him in a random pig, right? And uh, and have that pig give birth to a saber-toothed tiger uh, in the wild. And then, you know, have to worry about containing the saber-toothed tiger. Because obviously that's going to be a lot harder than uh, trapping a pig, first and foremost. So, a raptor sounds like he is uh, having fun in here. Let's see. Tyrone, are you older? No. No, you're still a baby. Why won't you grow up? Honestly, this is... It's just taking forever. Did he stop running? Tyrone? Are you okay? I don't hear breathing! <laughs> oh, God. Um, oh, where is he? Where is he? Tyrone! Oh, my God. Um... Oh. Oh! 
Oh, he was hiding in the bush. Oh, great. Okay. Well, he's full. All right. Um, is he a day older? No. Oh, okay. He, he's now the teleporting raptor, I guess. Um, the hell, Tyrone? What? What are you doing? Where did you go? You son of a gun. Oh, th great. Yeah, let's hide in grass, you freaking jerk. Oh my god, this is this is <laughs> this is not even funny. Come on. Seriously, you, you need to stand still so I can do my work, you know? There we go. There we go. Just lay down a stake and everything's fine. Now let's see here. One day old. One day old. Damn it. Okay. He's full now. Now he's still one day old. Weak. All right. Well, I should really start clearing away some of this crap. So, like, you know, I can access uh, Tyrone's log a little bit better. Maybe I'll do that in a little bit. I don't really want to do it right now because he seems very schizophrenic and uh, I'm scared to death that I'm going to accidentally hit him and maybe maybe if I hit him uh, he wouldn't like be nice and friendly to me anymore. Just saying. So we will go ahead and try to get some seeds out of the ground because we need to get some carrots so we can get a pig in captivity. Uh, that that is the goal here. Um, so just kind of like mowing the grass. My God, how do we go from like watching over a uh, creation that was 65 million years in the making to freaking mowing the lawn? Uh, that that is a rough transition. <laughs> yet yet here we are um, doing exactly that. Jesus. That is something else, you know? Alright. Well, I get eight seeds. Um, I, I think that that is quite impressive for, uh, for five minutes worth of work, you know? So maybe we can yield a, a carrot or something from that. Um, what do I need? for I'm, I'm gonna start doing a farm here because obviously we need to get a carrot going so time to bust out the corduroys and uh and head on down below and, and do all that we'll make a hoe and we need a shovel too just because it's gonna make work a lot easier um, you know, it's, it's really funny, right? I mean, I had Minecraft for, uh, for like roughly a year before I learned of a shovel. <laughs> I mean, it, it's, it's really, it's really quite comical. Um, like I, I would just be digging away and, uh, you know, minding my own business, not digging with the book, obviously, but I'm just kind of mapping out like how I want to do my trudge. But I, I never knew that there was a shovel. And then all of a sudden, one day, a friend of mine is like, "You, you know that there's shovels, right?" And I'm like, "No, there's not. Shut up. Don't, don't, don't even say that." And uh, sure enough, right? Sure enough. Um, that's just, you know, point being, you, you need to, uh, you need to be informed. <laughs> and I was not.